Oh, yeah, yeah, yo, 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 play the ward. Yeah, you're not a noob. Okay, Viego, you're really boosted for putting a ward like that. Okay, but this game after path top side, I think. Like, why is that? Enemy is Ziggs Braum. Like, honestly, Ziggs Braum, by the way, no joke, Ziggs Braum is like the biggest, the biggest, the biggest pussy lane that you can ever go. Ziggs Braum, I'm not even capping, it's like, it's like Paralympics. It's like, bro, you cannot kill them. Those two lanes is just like champions. Impossible. Yeah, what's up, B-Man? You'll DM me for a coaching sesh? <laughs> okay, okay, bro. Bro, I give you my Patreon videos. Class, bro. My videos should be enough for you to climb. Like, no cap. Like, I probably have... I mean, okay, I haven't watched all the people's courses, right? But my course is for sure the best. In the best. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. You see the bullet HP? They're very low HP. I see, that's an opportunity. So, they're bullet. Okay, pay attention to this. This is how you gank, okay? I know there's no wards. I know Viago's top side. What do I do? I'm gonna gank here from behind. I'm not paying on the way. The moment I'm behind them. Oh my god, that's better than Oh my god. No flash, no flash. Okay, I have to insta base here. I have to insta base in the top side here. Please, bro, don't cancel my base. If you cancel my base, you really cringe. Thank you. Have you done yoga today? I haven't done my yoga today. I mean, I did go for a 40 minute run into a 15 minute biking session. But it'll be tomorrow, the, the Pilates thingy. You ever coach top? I did actually. I mean, bro, I coached Wunder professionally, so. <laughs> I, I mean, I did coach pro. Okay, I didn't coach many like individuals in the normal. Um, do you get my point? I coach mostly pro top laners, not individuals, but I'm pretty sure I can coach individuals that are <laughs> not even master tier. No doubt about that one. But that's so bad. The moment he lands E, he actually flashed. But anyway, um, why did the rept clears often? Because um, usually, if you do full clear, you can take top crap, run into raptor golem, and base again for a better base. Essentially, that's more why. I'm this is my warm up game, so I'm being chilling a bit. But but I will still get the bread. I will still get the bread. But looking at this game, let me see how I get the bread here. Like I know Viego started both sides, so it should be ending up in the top side. Which also means that I can look for a gank here potentially. I'm gonna hide here a bit. And now I'm gonna go. I think this guy should be in the top side. What? Two tower shots, bruh? Oh, that's really close. Who we'll take this. Okay, my Zeb is 3 0. Oh my goodness. Oh! Bronzodia! Oh my god, it's a family! It's a fing familia here, dude! Oh my god, Ezreal! That's a mid laner, right? Oh, scheiße, boys, scheiße. Nicht gut. That's what you usually say in these cases. Nicht gut. Only because you can bot lane? Ain't no way, right?
Oh my goodness. I need to run for my goddamn life. And I'm still dead. Nicht good guys. It's fine guys. Farm is overrated. So, you know, there's a saying that when your AD carry is 3 0 and your top lane is ahem, 0 3, you should probably path bot side, guys. Or or has no point in R. Oh shit. Oh, she did not max ult, yeah. <laughs> Omega low. Actually, in Challenger, I guess that can still happen. Misclicking ultimate. Anyway, guys, it doesn't matter. You know, I'm currently 0 4. Will it matter, guys? Okay, guys, Madam 0 4. Do you guys think we still win the game? Mid lane 0 1. Do you guys think I lose this game? I will win this game, just so you guys know. Base here. Basing around the corner. Okay, this bush is warded, but I very certain. Uh, let me see. Let me go into the top side here. They will throw. Hello, Elena. I mean, uh, they will probably throw, yeah. Best to keep moving. Ironically. Well, we will win the game. You know, you know, right? I'm not even kidding here. Alright, okay, guys. I'll mute the chat, okay? I know it's the first game of the day. So usually, you know. <clears throat> Let's just put it this way that I'm a bit more of a chatter first game of the day, but. Say hello to the boys, but. I will show you guys how to win when you're in thing. <laughs> like, literally. Okay? So. Enemy has Trinity Force and I have two Amplifying Town. What do I do, guys? Hope you guys can all guess correctly. That would be to not contest. That would be to trade. So the moment he's on top side, I try to do something bot side. Like if I can take the Drake, that would be the best, because then I get to scale. Especially if you're behind, if you can join Drakes, it's really, really, really good. Especially if you outscale, okay? So right now I plan to do the bot crap here. I know for a fact that he could go into the bot side here, which he is, but no problem. I'll just take this little Krabby Patty here, and I'm out of here. I'll just poke this Brom for a bit. Why, why not? No! Okay, no flash on that guy, no flash on that guy. He has ultimate, right? But this time he has ultimate. But this time he didn't want to use it. It's fine guys, 0-5, it's, it's, it's a perfect. It's a perfect stat line. 5-0 for 0-5, 30 CS down. How to win in these games? Okay, first of all, have a mid laner, it's a bit human. But, all good, all good. It's just numbers after all. Being 0 5 or 5 0, you know, there is no difference. Uh, of course, I will look to move towards Misery. So, pay attention to what I'm gonna do, okay? You see this top side here? Omega Doomed. So, if you have 4 0 Zeri, in order to increase your chance of winning, you might want to consider playing for your Zeri. 5 0 Zeri. I'll show you guys why Bolin is so broken and why I always path both sides. You know, this, this early gank that I did, they're gonna save me. What will I do? Well, I will probably look for a base, because I've got my item power spike. And now, I have to put a mindset, which is that, okay, I'm behind. So what does it mean? That means that I don't decide what to play for. Enemy decides that. So, Herald's up in one minute. Can I contest the Herald? Do I win it? Well, probably not. So what will I do? I will look for a trade. And I'll play with Mazzeri. So the best thing we can do here is um, put a ward on the Herald. Ward groups. Okay, cool. 
So, ba ba da ba da ba 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 so, essentially, they have six groups, right, or not? I don't know how many groups they have. Anyway, it doesn't matter. They probably have six. Anyway, I will look to path bot side here. So, see Vieg on top side? You see what I'm doing now? I'm like, yo, attack bot side. So now, I'm CEO of sprinting bot lane. Run, 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 no flash, nothing. Ult him. Q him. Yeah. 500 gold in pocket. The first comeback. Now I ping my mid and pop. Hey, don't die, please. Be careful. They pop Herald mid lane. No problem. We play to defend while Zeri pushes and get resources. Don't die, please. What the f? Oh, Bron can block that. Okay, we lost two towers, but no problem. Our boy Zeri is getting farm. Anyway, right now, what are we playing for? We're playing for top tower. Do you see how Drake spawned in two minutes? Are we contesting it? No, we're not. We are trading. I'm basing here and running top set here. And I'll get magic pen boots and a dark seal. So, as of right now, we want to play for top tower. All my top set camps are up. So they all play for bot tower, right? They do have 6 groups, so they're actually a bit faster. So I'm thinking, okay, do I want to defend bot lane maybe, but all my top six games are up. I think this is just life. Okay, we give all the resources to Zeddy. We just play to the tent here. But do you see how we kill one person? One guy should always stay to continue pushing. So now he gets top tower, he gets the next wave, and this gives us mana advantage. Because now one of them has to go top lane here, right? For well, obvious reasons. And I will take his mid lane right here, no problem. If no one wants it, I'll take it. <laughs> My Drake 20 seconds. So the question you have to ask yourself here is, can you contest this Drake? Well, I've got my doubts. So, yeah, this is good. As you can see here, we're just trading objectives. You see how they go for Drake? We go for top tower. That is a bit unfortunate. That is a bit unfortunate, guys. It's like 1 HP. Look at the own smart move. This is like actually like a lot of gold. Okay. I'm not sure if it's the ultimate here, but you know. Okay, not like that. Anyway, all good, all good. No worries, guys. No worries. Like, right now. What are they playing for? They're probably playing for topside control. This Baron's up 140, right? What does this mean for us? Defensive ward stop side. Holy moly! Yo! That's Q. I cringed it. Okay, it's fine. They die, they die, they die. We take those. Okay. If it hit the Q by the we would have crushed it really hard. But we would one shit down there and we kill Brom. That's actually not even that bad. We take that. So my Zeri when I eat 600, okay.
Okay, okay. Yeah, beautiful, magnificent. Triple kill. No words, no words, no words. That's okay, that's alright. Small victories, small victories. Don't get greedy, guys. Don't get greedy. Because I know they have teleports. Take the small victories, base, and go for another fight. Mm. I think they're on it, but I. Londola! Whoa. I think we stopped them here. We stopped them here. That's not bad. I got my item here as well. We got mid tower here. Drake in 50 seconds. Who should be top lane? Yo should be top lane. Anyway, since Drake's in 30 seconds, okay, the question becomes again. Do I want to contest it? I don't. Yeah, shit. He came to the right conclusion. So what do I do here? I push bot lane. Why do I push bot lane? To just make someone show here. And then I get topside control here. You can see here, I'm just I'm just trading. I'm just pushing a wave, making them show. Now we should hopefully get numbers on topside. And we play topside. Now we just play in our zone. You see here, they have full bottom control. We have full topside control here. Press Q maybe. Not bad, yeah, yeah. Uh, I think it's fine. Small victories, guys. Remember, small victories. That is not small victories. That is int, I would say. This difference between like, okay guys, it's time to clutch them. This is the moment you've all been waiting for. That's fine. We take that. We take those boys. We take those. I don't think they're better now. I think I cancelled them. Diego's too low. We see here, I'm like very patient. You know, trading objectives. I'm 4 8, I have 1 4 top, 0 5 mid. But we're just playing macro here. And not, not greedy like dogs. Oh shit. Run away, boys. That's okay. Even here, we have to give Baron. It's just life. I would say it is what it is, you know? Why is my Orianna like... like my Orianna is like looking like a wind trader. Just, just so you guys know. I will look to go bot side here. I'll look to yoink all his bot side camps. Let's see what I can yoink. Let's see what I can find here. You can see here, I'm just like yoinking all his camps here. This is 300 gold by equivalent to one kill that I'm denying as well. Okay, Renekton for sure is gonna go bull in here and is Baron, so I can't push that. Instead, I'll just take my camps. Boom, 
bomba. Ah, acho que é bomba ter. Não é um beijo quick for item. Yo, 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 look bullet, look bullet, look bullet. Okay, you're on the mission, yeah? Yeah, not bad. Drake, 40 seconds. Basing here for some items. Basing, getting items. Guys, if you get this Drake, guys, just saying, we're winning the game here. We are winning the game here. Six was top lane, so I don't think anyone's here. Oh boy. That is a Drake in my books. Hmm. Enemy team starting to sweat right now. They're probably like, fuck guys, we need to not stop throwing guys. Not looking good, that is correct, it's not looking good for them. We stay in bushy here, see what happens. If nothing happens, well nothing happens, you know. Might ping back, can I have some wars here? Now we take this tower as well guys. Some money in the pocket, and now we're out. And now we've got my item powers back. I'm telling you guys, enemy team is really starting to sweat right now. Despite having like a 0 10 to top side, we are winning this game. How are we winning this game? We are trading objectives. We are taking very slowly small victories, and slowly but surely, we are gonna win this game. And now we just play for top side. Baron is up in two minutes. So we're playing for Baron essentially. So right now, it's all about all. It's all about understanding how do you get the bad advantage. This is the reason here. I should be able to push this solo because we see Renekton here. Did you sit here? I think now. If no one wants to yoink it, I can yoink it. Hello. Okay, do you guys know why I'm yoinking this wave? I'm yoinking this wave to make this little boy show here. Essentially, I'm the split pusher here. And now it's 30 seconds before the objectives. So what will I do here? After I join these camps here, I will group with my team. I'm not sure if I can this one, but... We're clutching it! Double kill! Triple kill! What? Why is he being Zeri, bro? I'm flat smurfing here. Anyway, I'm gonna chase down the Renekton here. I'm gonna cancel his base, if I can, of course. What's up, bro? Renekton showing ball lane. And now we go towards the Baron. Let's get the bread. Let's get the bread. We're viewing teleport as well. Now it's a free Baron. And now Drake's up in one minute as well. Zeri deals more damage than me, so the guy that deals more damage should almost always be uh, not tanking. So right now, crucial part, crucial part. You see how Viego is spawning in two seconds? If I base right now, and I sprint your bot side instantly... Leona! Bot side! Where the f*** are you going? Bot side, bro. Break up! So now, 
Young Sugar bot lane. Orianna should take this wave and group. I'm gonna ping my Boriana to group. Right now, get Vision Ward here. Go, go, go. Yeah, you could be here. Hey, these guys are skill checking you. Don't get skill check, bro. Dodge some abilities. I cannot dodge that one. Renekton in my face for some reason. Hitting him. Oh, oh, that looks like a bo banger, but. Help me! Okay. Like, why the f am I shoutcasting man? in fing playing a teamfight, guys? Man, it's like the most important teamfight in the game. I shouldn't do that. They for sure win this, but right? Okay. I like what I'm seeing. I don't like what I'm seeing. You have no smite. Wait me. I don't think you smite win this, but I just saying, just just don't. No, 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 no. Oh my god, guys, why do you guys hit the Drake guys? Are you guys stupid? It's fine guys. My laners clearly do not deserve farm. Anyway, since my Zerius take my top side, I will take the bot side here. I mean, in general, rule right, if enemy has Baron, try to take the waves. If you can take the waves, really good. Like, I actually know how to split push. This time I'm not gonna shoutcast. They do have the most stupid shit when it comes to wave clearing, so. Well, Baron's coming up in two minutes. Hello! An enemy has been slain, Leona, um, stealing from your Eddie Carry and its owner. Anyway guys, believe it or not guys, we are winning this game, we are winning this game. But how do you win the game from now? How do you win the game? Baron is 2 minutes. You can see I've been pushing side lane the whole time. It's for a reason. It's to get man advantage, to get farm, and right before the objective spawns, we are chilling. So anyway, Baron here up in 140. Leona, robot, with your my Zeri should never be able to die on midnight. I hope. Unless he's boosted, but he's not boosted. Okay, now I ping my laners to be careful. Because I'm shadowing my bot side here. And now, this Renekton, by the way, just saying. You see, we have a wave. They don't have a wave. We're faster. We're faster, you send it. See the teleport here? Good choice. Alright guys, we're doing two people's lives. the game here. And that's how you win from behind. So how did we win? We just won because I traded objectives, I took small victories, and slowly but surely you win the game. In a challenger game, by the way. So as you can see, um, 0-10 top lane can always win.
But uh, you could see that, you know, despite having a very interesting early game, like, <sighs> very interesting early game, you can always win a game. Never FF. And that's why Bolin is broken. <laughs>